Hello, in this video tutorial we are going to look at how to change the image on your teacher web page. So the first thing you're going to do is navigate to your page and once you are at your page then you are going to log in to the website. Once you log in it will open up and you will have the toolbar here now across the top of the page to edit the page. We want to go to design mode and click where it says off to turn our page on in design mode. And we want to edit this portlet where the picture is sitting. So I'm going to click on the edit button. And then I'm going to find the image and I'm going to click on the image to highlight it. From our toolbar in our editor we're going to find this icon which is the image manager and we're going to click on that icon. If you get this message at the top, you can just click OK, and it should take you right into the image manager. From here, if you do not already have a folder created on the page, then you need to come over and click on Add Folder, and you need to add your uh, teacher name in there. So I'm going to add mine as Kelly K, and I'm going to click OK. Once I've done that, a folder will be added with my name. You need to make sure you have a folder to upload your uh, pictures into. Then you're going to double click on that folder to open it up. And right now, mine is empty. There's no records to display. So I need to upload the picture that I want to use. So once I click on Upload, I'm going to click Select, and it's going to let me browse to my pictures. So I'm going to click on Pictures and I'm going to go down and I'm going to find the image that I want to upload. So I'm going to upload this picture here. I click on it one time and I click open. You'll notice that it is uploading here and now once I have the green dot then that tells me the picture is ready to upload. I click the upload button and it is going to upload that picture into my folder. The next thing I want to do is click on Properties. This is very important depending on the size of your picture. You want to look and see which one of the numbers here on the width and height is the largest. And you want to look over here to the right where these two little links are and you want to click on those links so that that link goes together. Because what's going to happen is as I change one number, as if that's linked, it will change both numbers. So I find the largest number. I'm going to erase that out of there and I'm going to type in 150. So you'll notice that the top number changed as well. For the border color, you can either choose red or black. Um, I think I'll go with black for my page and we will set our border width to 2. At this point, you should just be able to click insert and it will put that picture on your page. Once the picture is on the page, you click on publish and once it publishes, you will have your new picture on your page. Thank you very much.